Well, another interesting story here. Uh, it's May 25th. This swarm started out in the backyard of my cousin. that lives about a mile from here. And I thought they were going to go in a trap over there. Get my jacket. Uh, but they didn't. I followed them with my car and I lost them and I came home because they were headed in this direction. And so here we are. Uh, I guess I think this is my uh, third swarm for 2015. Come on, get down here. Can you hold the camera for a while? Here, just hold it until I get this on. Okay. That's hard to believe that they came that far. I thought they were going to go in that box and then they decided to go in this one. Gee, Manny, that's going a on long over there. That's a long way. What's going on over there? Oh no, they're going in that box too. Which box are they choosing? I don't they're know. side by side practically. Oh, they're going to have to make up their mind because they might they might have a mistake going on over there, and they're all, everybody else is over here. That's what it is. I don't is. know what's going on, but... Uh, you can show it down there. Okay, um, well, I guess we don't actually know what's going on here. They're swarming at this box, but this box over here, they seem to be going in too. So I don't know if I have two different swarms going on or what. What's happening? This is crazy. Remember, these bees came from about a mile away because I followed them. Come here and help me. Okay, uh, well the camera went off. I wanted to get a little bit closer, but this one here, it appears they're going in okay. I always like to get up here where you can see how they sort of funnel into this. This is a fairly small swarm, but I'll take it. This is May 25th. Is this my third one, hon? Cool. I know people like to see close-ups, so I'll do the best I can here. I don't still don't, I think there's another swarm at the same time. I don't know if I can if I get back here, if you can see the box in the front and the one on the left in the back. This one is very busy. They're just starting. I might have two swarms here. I'm not sure. get the best light conditions. I'm going to just take a walk down here and take a look at this one over here. They're 
coming, but they're coming real slow here, I think. Unless this is just still the scout bees. Man, I don't know what it is about these boxes. Let's go back over here. I started out over at my cousin's house about a mile away. I had a trap over there because there was a, uh, a swarm hanging in a tree and I just put a box up and they took off right over my head so I got in the car and chased them and they actually came to my house. This, is, this box is in my backyard. So that's pretty Pretty unique, I think. I'm going to go down here at this other one and see. I don't know what these girls are doing, so unless this is just another hive that is scouting, I can't really tell yet. That's what it almost looks like to me. So, I'm going to go back to this tree here. So, that tells me that these scouts go at least one mile because that's how far away. I'm, I'm pretty sure I, I chased these with the car and I couldn't see them all the way, but a good part of the way. I was able to see it and uh, so I, I'm gonna cut it off here uh, see what's gonna happen next this is the bee catcher May 25th caught one on May 25th of last year too let's take a quick peek up in here so you can see how they funnel in. It's really kind of neat. So I guess I'll have to shut it off now. <laughs>